guys, I am back with another decluttering video. Um, I don't know if actually this one's going up first or my nail polish decluttering video, but either way, um, I will link the nail polish one down below if I do post that first. But we are going to declutter my lipstick tower today. I do have more lip products um, up there, but um, today is just going to be the lip tower. So let's get started. All right, uh, I'm gonna have to stand up for this one. Um, these are like these little samples and stuff that I got from Ipsy when I used to have Ipsy. Um, I'm gonna get rid of this one. And then of course, if you wanna know any particular brand or um, like if you see a color that you like, please let me know and I will let you guys know what shade it is. Um, I'll try to show you as much as I, I can, but um, I'm going to keep all of the ones, uh, that I want to keep here and then all the ones that I'm going to get rid of over here. So this one, what is this one? The Tartiest lip paint. So this is in the shade birthday suit and I think it was like a Sephora free little gift. I'm going to keep this one. NARS. Let's see. Oh yeah, that one's like brand new. <laughs> uh, I haven't worn lipstick in a long time since we have started wearing masks. So this is Tartiest Exposed. All these little sample ones I actually do like to keep because of, um, well, <laughs> I say traveling, but one day when we get to travel again, I do want like a very convenient small size lipstick and these are also really nice to put in purses they don't take up much room so I'm gonna keep those and let's go through one by one um, first I guess I'm just gonna do like uh, just the colors because I don't really have a tripod with me right now. <laughs> so um, I'm just gonna do it by color and then I'm gonna go back in to these and like smell them and check them out, make sure there's no mold or it didn't go bad in any way. So, but for now, I'm definitely gonna keep all of these colors. Uh, well, this one, I'm gonna get rid of that one. Let's see, I love this, but these are so similar in color. I think I'm gonna keep this one. And get rid of that one. Um, oh my gosh. Ugh. I'm gonna get rid of that one too. This one is actually really pretty for summer. Um, I really love these from Anastasia. So I'm gonna keep those. And, and this one from Stila is really nice as well. Huda Beauty. I love this one. And Transcender. Um, oh my gosh, do you guys remember these NYX butter glosses when every YouTuber had these? <laughs> um, these are actually really nice, but um, I'm going to see if it's still good because it's been a while since I've had it. This one, let's see, Too Faced Melted Matte. Um, Hank and Hen Henry, I, I don't think I've ever actually worn this one other than reviewing it for my channel, so I'm going to get rid of that one. This one is by Bite Beauty. This used to live in my purse, which is why it's all banged up. Uh, this one, I love the packaging on this. I think the brand is du Duce? Duce? I'm not sure, but you just click it and it comes out. So I really like that one. And it's a, it's a red shade. It's just hard to show you guys <laughs> with one hand, but uh, let's see. Oh, this is by Rimmel. Hmm, it's a nude. You can never have enough nudes, you know what I mean? Let's see. This one is like a very hot, bright pink. <sighs> um, this one is such a pretty brown shade. Let's see. It's called Bebot Love. Bebo Love? It's by Wet n Wild. Um, and this one is also very, very, very pretty. I remember this one, but I forgot the shade name. It's number 11, in case you wanted to know. This one, I don't think I'll ever let go because this is like, I think my first ever 
real lipstick, you know, and it's by Estee Lauder. It's called Sunstone. This was the only lipstick I would wear um, for like super special occasions. Um, so I'm going to keep that one. This one, oh gosh. Okay, the ones that are hard to get, I'll get last. So I'm going to move on. Um, this one, Vivid Matte Lip. Um, this one, let me see if I can remember. I actually do like the formula of this one. So. Oops. <laughs> Just dropping everything. Um, this one I'm going to keep. This one I'm going to let go. Oh, this one from Dose of Colors called Charmed, or just Charm, I think. Um, I actually got it in my Boxy Charm. I wore this all last year, so I really like that color. This one's just a plain gloss, which I love plain glosses, so I'm going to keep that. Beautiful red. I don't even know what color this used to be, so I'm going to get rid of that. Um... Oh, this is the new Sol de Janeiro. Yeah, I just recently got this in my boxy charm. Look at this packaging, though. So cute, and I love this. It's like very, very moisturizing. So I'm gonna definitely keep that one. Another Stila. I'm gonna keep that. My first Mac lipstick, which I just got in my most recent boxy charm. Definitely keeping that. Um, this shade is absolutely beautiful. Tower of Mauve. Super pretty on, um, brown skin tones. Uh, like around my skin tone. Let's see. This one, I think I'm gonna get rid of this one too, but this one was such a pretty color. Cinnamon Spice. Oh my gosh. I used to wear this all the time. Yeah. Um, these... Milani lipsticks, I love. I love the smell of them. And this shade was so nice. Rose Femme. I'm going to keep that one. And this one, ew, oh my gosh. Coraline. I really like this one, but let me see if I can clean this up. Make sure it's still good, and then I'll keep it. This one, I was like really into orange lipsticks at one point. <laughs> So this one's called Tropical Coral. I actually really like the smell of these lipsticks from L'Oreal. They just remind me of my childhood. I feel like my mom used to always carry a lipstick like this or something. I don't know, but I remember this scent so much from my childhood. So <sighs> yeah, and this is another orange shade, same brand. It's literally, I think just like, yeah, very similar. It looks even more similar in like when you swatch it. So I'm going to see if I can get rid of one of those. This one is so old. I think I got it from Kmart. <laughs> Do they still have Kmarts? Yeah, Kmart used to be like my favorite store ever. I don't know why they got rid of it, but um, I think there are just a few more left, but this one I'm gonna get rid of. This trio from Half Caked is new so i'm gonna keep these and i have some more lips i love this nars red i think it's called cruella or rec is it yeah cruella super super pretty and i'm sorry if my camera i'm using my phone so it's it's not the best camera um this one in plum rose is actually a very pretty shade um, especially if you have, again, a similar skin tone to mine. This one is broken. So I'm going to get rid of that. What color is this? I love the packaging. Oh. A nude. I love nudes. So I'm going to keep that one. Um, and another nude. <laughs> All right, halfway done. Let's see, this one's another L'Oreal one. Oh, I think I know this one. This was when they had different nudes for like different celebrities or something like that. I use that one a lot. So I'm gonna keep that. 
Um, I have another one right here. Um, this is actually Frida Pinto's nude. Um, I was like obsessed with her when Slumdog Millionaire came out. <laughs> so, okay, these, oh, these are those glitter flip lippies, but, um, I don't think I'll ever actually wear that. So I'm gonna get rid of that. And then this one is Americano. I really like that shade and the brand. Another Stila, gonna keep that. Another Anastasia, gonna keep that. All of these NYX butter glosses. Well, I'm gonna get rid of these two. And I'm gonna keep these nudes. Those are like ones that I like to just keep in my purse. Um, this one is called Mauve Wife. Mm, I'm gonna get rid of that one. And I'm gonna get rid of this one too. This one is called Mochalicious. And uh, this shade is so pretty. But uh, I'm gonna see if, it, if I can clean it up and if it still smells good, so. <laughs> um, this one again, man, this brand, Duce, has really good packaging. Let's see, what shade this is? Red, ooh, I love red. Okay, I'm gonna see. Uh, I have to think about this one. Um, Real Her, this one is actually really nice, but I have so many shades that are this like almost exact shade. <sighs> um, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of it. This one, oh, I love this shade, Pasadena, so nice. This one is Rosebud, never wear this. All right, so sorry about that, I had a call, but let's move on. Um, these, Oh my gosh, these are so nostalgic. I think these were probably one of my first ever lipsticks ever, and I still have them. Like, since I was a little kid, these are like these mood changing, mood color lipsticks or something like that. I don't know, but very cool. Um, they all turn like different shades of pink. <laughs> so I don't know what each one means. But um, yeah, these I literally keep just for nostalgia. Oh, my hair is everywhere. Oh my gosh, sorry about that. But yeah, anyways, I, I think I'm gonna keep these unless it's like like really horrible smelling, which I don't know what these were made of, but, but like I've had these forever and they never smell or anything. So I don't, I don't know how um, good these are for your body, but. <laughs> But I never wear these anymore, so. Because they stain like crazy. Once you have them on, it's like, it takes a week for these to come off. But moving on, I have this one from Hourglass. I actually really like this, like this uh, chubby pencil. And this one from Burt's Bees Blush Basin. I actually like this one, like, well, the color of it. But um, the formula... I don't know if I just got a bad one, but it's not that great. So I'm gonna get rid of that one. This Clarins Velvet Lip is exactly what it sounds like. It's so soft and velvety on the lips. I'm definitely gonna keep this. Um, let's see, all of these I'm gonna keep. I am obsessed, absolutely obsessed with these uh what are they what is the actual it's like maybelline something these are the maybelline color sensational or color riche matte lipsticks the absolute best that the drugstore has to offer even i feel like any brand that i've ever tried drugstore and non-drugstore these are just amazing so i would highly recommend um let's see these I'm gonna get rid of, although they're very pretty, but I'm gonna get rid of that. This one, another nude, but this one is in the shade Cool Nude, and it's by Essence. Um, I actually like this shade, but I never wear it, so I'm just gonna 
get rid of that. This color, I don't know. I think I got it from Ipsy. I would probably never wear this shade, so I'm gonna get rid of that. Um, love this bite lip uh, pencil. It's in glace or glace, glace. I don't even know. It has a a little accent on there, but wow, the like I love this shade. I wear it to almost out like every spring. <laughs> Okay, so I was on the phone for quite some time with my parents, so uh, I just went ahead and decided to do all the lipsticks and lip pencils that I had that were up there, and this is what we have. Um, these are all the ones that um, did not go bad, so that's good, and these are all the ones that are bad they smell horrible so uh and some of them aren't even that old which is kind of surprising but anyways i'm gonna throw all of those away and then these are all ones that um uh i'll probably give to my sister or something because i just i don't know i never wear them so and then these i'm gonna be keeping <laughs> so i still have a large majority that i'm keeping but, um, yeah. Anyways, uh, I'm going to get this cleaned up and packaged up. And I will talk to you guys later. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a big thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!